Hello, welcome back to the channel. This week we're going to do another virtual walkthrough. We're going to take a look at the Juno 1095, pictured right there. It is an outboard powered cruiser, and since we're a cruising channel, we're going to take a look at another boat that is a little bit smaller than Calypso, but this, this one is a high value boat. She starts at under 300,000, so come on along. And remember, if you like this kind of content, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell so you're notified when new content comes out, and please pound that thumbs up button and make sure you hit a like. We'd love to hear your comments as well. So this week's boat is the Juno NC Weekender 1095. It is the largest boat in the Weekender series. It's also offered in a Flybridge model, and it is one of six series of boats that Juno makes. It's outboard powered, and because this is a cruising channel, we're sticking with the cruising line that Juno offers. They do also offer a number of boats that are both diesel stern drive and pod drive. A little background on Genot. They are part of Group Beneteau, which is a French builder and one of the largest builders of boats in the world. They build both power boats and sailboats and own a number of brands you may have heard of, including Glastron, Wellcraft, Scarab, and they also make a number of large super yachts as well. So let's jump into this week's boat. The Genot 1095 is a 34 foot long boat of the coupe style which has become very popular she has a nice salon above decks and a number of staterooms below decks and a single head she competes usually with the cruisers and regal yachts and previously with sea ray but as those who are familiar with the channel sea ray has exited the market several years ago and has let left a bit of a vacuum you don't see as many Genos as you do of the American builders, but they are increasingly popular because they are a high-value boat. This one in particular starts at under $300,000. The NC-1095 is a 34-foot boat on an 11-foot beam. She draws 2 feet 3 inches with the outboards down and weighs approximately 10,600 pounds. She carries 212 gallons of fuel and approximately 68 gallons of water and is powered by twin 300 horsepower engines. In this case, they are Yamaha. Starting aft, the cockpit has L-shaped seating. Moving into the salon, she has forward and aft dinette and a galley up along with the um, pilot seat. The boat does have an asymmetrical layout, and what this means is that there is a walkway to starboard to get forward, but on the port side, there is a much reduced access. Moving below, you can see this particular version has three staterooms, one forward, one starboard, and one port slightly aft, and one head with a separate shower. Now let's take a virtual walkthrough of the Juno NC1095. Sit back and enjoy.
So I think we're going to wrap this video up here. Hope you enjoyed our virtual walkthrough of the NC1095. If you want to see more virtual walkthroughs, please put that in the comments below. And again, subscribe and hit the like button. Really helps us out. And we will see you next time. Take care. Thank you.